The wait is over. There are few bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. It's Borussia Dortmund. They face Paris Saint-Germain and it's coming up live here on EA. It is something very special indeed to make it to a UEFA Champions League final. Now these two teams are intent upon tasting glory. Welcome to the showpiece event on the European club calendar. Derek Ray here in the commentary position, joined tonight for live coverage by Stuart Robson. It is Borussia Dortmund against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, what a night, Derek. Two great teams, a perfect pitch, a magnificent stadium and millions watching around the world. What more could you ask for, apart from maybe different commentators? Introducing the Borussia Dortmund side. Mats Hummel starts alongside Niklas Zule at the back. Marco Reus plays alongside Emre Can in the centre of midfield. And the striker of choice is the powerful and the lethal Sebastian Allaire. Introducing the Paris Saint-Germain starters. Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts. Fabian plays alongside Vitor Ferreira in central midfield. And handed the task of playing up front today is Kylian Mbappe. This is it, the Champions League final. They are underway. Who will be crowned club kings of Europe? Hugo Ekitike. This attack looks highly promising. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Karim Adeyemi. Emre Can. No way through. Oh, the referee has given it. Penalty it is. And into the book he goes too. Well, once he gave the penalty, he was always going to give him a yellow card. Can he make it 1-0? And a goal! He was composure personified and he's done his job from the spot. Well, here it is again and just watch the keeper. He stands still hoping it's hit down the middle. Unfortunately for him, he's got it wrong. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Kylian Mbappe. Now they stopped them in their tracks. Niklas Zule. Emre Can. Ekitike. Tike. 
Fabian. Can he find the net? Able to get a body in the way. Well, Dortmund being afforded too much room. Well, keeping it on the ground, slightly off target, however. Kylian Mbappe. Chance to do damage. But nothing comes of it. Fabian. And the keeper not really taxed by that long range shot. Possession given away. Aller. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Not a great pass. Wolf. Now with Allaire. And it's a quality pass. But he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Mbappe. Given away by PSG. Karim Adeyemi. Well, not a bad plan of action, but through to the goalkeeper it goes. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Ferreira. And support available. And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Can he take the chance? And there it is! A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. A trophy coming their way, surely. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging someone to get on the end of it. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Two-nil now, and back underway. Fabian attacking possibilities for PSG well nothing comes of it it looked promising well as you can see Dortmund are struggling to control possession but when they oh, have Stuart, had it... they might be onto something here and still a chance Guerrero Here's Royce. The supporters want to see him have a go. Oh, a powerful effort. Close. Hey. 
and he read it well defensively Dembele Fabian oh fancy footwork could be and quite simply a wonderful chance was squandered Marco Reus Both. Well, space if he goes inside. But timely defending when it mattered. Fabian. Mbappe with it. And the counter attack is on. Options available. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. And the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. <laughs> 45 minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. He might be able to profit from the wide position. Chance here. Well, body in the way. Plenty of support here. Could be. Just can't get it past them. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. And the cross sends in by Royce. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Plenty of options. But quick thinking defensively. And PSG will have a throw in. Hugo Ekitike. Mbappe. Textbook defending inside the box. Oh, this is looking promising. Prime tackle there to prevent the chance. Adeyemi. Running with the ball confidently. Cross could be useful. He might be onto something. Brilliantly blocked. They've lost possession, Paris Saint Germain. And support available. Oh, what an opportunity! And it's been finished off by Marco Royce. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. So the ball moving again. And it's turning into a trouncing, you've got to say. Dortmund hold all the aces. Good looking move this. Tempele. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. Might really be able to trouble them here. And this is Royce. Very quick thinking there. Could be a chance to break here. Mbappe, it might be, it's gone in, and well he might celebrate on the back of that.
Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And from that sort of range, you'd be shocked if Mbappe missed out. He just keeps showing us what a top finisher he is. So back underway, 3-1 the score. Hakimi, Ferreira, Dembele, could pull one back here, oh and it goes, another goal, and I'll tell you what, the impossible is becoming quite possible. Well let's look at this again, to pick out this pass shows wonderful vision, it's inch perfect, while the movement in the box is equal to it, it's such good timing, what a goal. away again and we're being treated to plenty of goals 3-2 at the moment Rice an encouraging move from Dortmund he's in behind and a goal to increase the lead in this final will they be stopped now Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Dembele he knows he's got to react well the attack finally comes to nothing and the keeper has it and the right place to cut out the pass well can they be creative from here Chance to reduce the arrears. Oh, fine stop. It is going to be a Dortmund free kick. No yellow card. Instead, a firm warning from the official. Sebastian Allaire. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Dembele. Well, still an issue here. And problem solved for now. Ten minutes to go then. Now able to. Is it going to be? Marco Royce! In it goes to rubber stamp it once and for all. Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Well, five minutes remaining, but you just feel this is over already. Struggling to keep the ball.
Well, this game almost in the books and a story of Dortmund excelling, Stuart. Well, what can you say about this performance? They've been absolutely brilliant. They've played with such guile and creativity and their passing has been so expansive. Not many teams would have stopped them today. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. Played over. And a little too close to the keeper in the end. Now can they counter clinically? Defenders need to cover. And waiting for it is Emre Chan. Well, not the best clearance. Brandt. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. How about this? Borussia Dortmund have only gone and won the UEFA Champions League. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Borussia Dortmund. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.